The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier, and our first reading is taken from the book of the prophet Isaiah. In the year of King Uzziah's death, I saw the Lord seated on a high and lofty throne. His train filled the sanctuary. Above him stood seraphs, each one with six wings, two to cover its face, two to cover its feet, and two for flying. And they were shouting these words to each other, Holy, holy, holy is Yahweh Sabaoth. His glory fills the whole earth. The doorposts shook at the sound of their shouting, and the temple was full of smoke. And then I said, Woe is me, I am lost, for I am a man of unclean lips, and I live among a people of unclean lips, and my eyes have seen the king, Yahweh Sabaoth. Then one of the seraphs flew to me, holding in its hand a live coal, which it had taken from the altar with a pair of tongs. With this, it touched my mouth and said, Look, this has touched your lips. Your guilt has been removed and your sin forgiven. I then heard the voice of the Lord saying, Whom shall I send? Who will go for us? And I said, Here am I. Send me. And our response is taken from Psalm 93. Yahweh is king, robed in majesty, robed as Yahweh and girded with power. The world is indeed set firm, it can never be shaken. Your throne is set firm from of old. From all eternity you exist. Your decrees stand firm, unshakable. Holiness is the beauty of your house, Yahweh for all time to come. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. Jesus said, The disciple is not superior to the teacher, nor the slave to the master. It is enough for the disciple to grow to be like the teacher and the slave like the master. Now if they have called the master of the house Beelzebul, how much more the members of his household. So do not be afraid of them. Everything now covered up will be uncovered, and everything now hidden will be made clear. What I say to you in the dark, tell in the daylight. What you hear in whispers, proclaim from the housetops. Do not be afraid of those who kill the body, but cannot kill the soul. Fear him, rather, who can destroy both body and soul in hell. Can you not buy two sparrows for a penny? And yet, not one falls to the ground without your father knowing. Why, every hair on your head has been counted. So there is no need to be afraid. You are worth more than many sparrows. So if anyone declares himself for me in the presence of human beings, I will declare myself for him in the presence of my Father in heaven. But the one who disowns me in the presence of human beings, I will disown in the presence of my Father in heaven. The Gospel of the Lord.